classically crafted South Dakota inspired. South Dakota ingredients are incredibly important to Miner in that it is our heartbeat, it is who we are, it is our essence. Uh, it showcases what we can do here in South Dakota as well. We have a different energy here, we have a unique energy here, and that energy goes into the fruit and translates into the product. And that's what people come here for, is they come here to, to experience that. They experience it here at Minor Brewing Company, they experience it at Prairie Berry Winery through our product. They purchase our product, take it back home, and that energy is still in that product, and they experience that when they're back home. They feel South Dakota. Foraging for different unique products is incredibly inspiring and exciting. What else is out there? What is edible? What is uh, in nature here? What can we utilize? What really represents South Dakota? What really represents 605? Choke cherries, they are probably the most, or at least one of the most versatile little berries ever. Just the berry itself is so inspirational to me. They can become pretty much anything. It could be a a fruit. You can you can just have a nice, wonderful fruit off of the tree. Um, it can be a, a jam. It can be a jelly. It can be a wine. It can be a syrup. Um, and there are so many things that it can be that it's it's a fruit that is just highly respectful, or you want to be very respectful of it, and to honor it in one of our products, it's just amazing. We have sourced. Honey locally from the very beginning of when we started Prairie Berry Winery. John Stoley uh, of Stoley Avery in Sturgis, South Dakota, works with the bees and gathers it. And it's the freshest honey you can possibly use or utilize. And what makes it so, so exciting every year to uh, use that in our honey lager is it changes from year to year, uh, depending on how much uh, water we have. Uh, you know, if it's a dry year, the honey can be a little more nutty, um, and it creates a different attribute. We make meads as well, uh, melomels, methaglins, which are uh, honey fermented with um, spices, honey fermented with fruits, uh, all kinds of things. The list is endless. The product that we make utilizing fresh South Dakota honey and it is just wonderful and it's delightful and it's always different it's always changing because you cannot guarantee uh, what mother nature is going to do from year to year but that's what makes it incredibly exciting to produce our products is that we start out and, and it becomes what it wants to be that's also South Dakota that is 605 Happy 605 day.